So here is something that is vitally important, something that I have come to realize, which is, if there is something that is extremely important in your life that is necessary for your existence to be more productive, to be more purposeful, for your existence to be fulfilled for what you came here to do. I'm going to tell you one thing that I found out. I'm going to tell you one thing that I have found out is that there is nobody who is going to be able to accomplish this for you except you. For example, if you are waiting for a, a, a spirit being or if you are waiting for an angel, if you are waiting for a family member, if you are waiting for an ancestor to come into your existence and physically do something for you, they are not. The thing about ancestors and source and spirit guides and ascended masters who assist us on our journey here is that they assist us with wisdom on a spiritual level. They whisper words of advice to you in your spirit or in your dreams and they whisper encouragement and they whisper these spirit beings including source itself can only work with you at spirit being angels source the ascended masters before us can only work with you at a level of power that you give to them so if you are at home and you know that it's vitally important for you on a spiritual and energetical level to meditate and to balance your energy and to align your energies that way you can have a more balanced focus day and with inner peace if you know that this is important and you're just lying there lethargically thinking oh I can't do it because A, B, C, and D and procrastinating. There is no spirit being that is going to come and meditate for you. You have to do it. There is no spirit being that is going to get in the car and drive you to the place that you need to be. There is no spirit being that is going to appear and remove all of the obstacles out of your life. You must give them that power in a spiritual level and it is you no one is coming to save you except you you are your own savior you are your own messiah it is all you the power has been given to you this is your life this is your universe this is all you you take your life and your universe and you mold it and design it and make it and create it the way that you want it to be the only thing that spirit guides and spirits can do is whisper words of advice and wisdom to you which is extremely important but they're not going to come down here and do the work for you in fact you have to get up and dust off the dust and fix your hair and your makeup and get in your car and drive to point a and point b to accomplish the purpose for your life you have to get up and sit up straight put your feet flat on the ground and do that meditation you have to get up and sit in silence so that you can hear the voice of source of spirit you have to do it no one will do it for you I was hoping somebody would do it for me, but uh, I realized that I've been waiting and waiting and peering up at the sky and God did not peek out. He didn't peek out to help me. I had to help myself. I had to do it by myself. I had to do it all by myself. And then after I've done it myself, the whole universe and the whole world, the whole everybody around me is blessed because that's what the spirits are waiting for. The spirits are waiting for you to make the first move. They're waiting, they're waiting. And in the spiritual dimensions, they're like, ooh, ooh, she's about to move. She's about to move, she moved, boom. There it is. But you gotta make the move. You have to make the move. So let me turn left here, right? As I'm going to go to work. I will see you guys later. Remember, you make the move. 
and the spirits will flow. Make the move, ask the questions. Put a demand on the power of God. Put a demand on source. Put a demand on spirit. And after you do, make the necessary move. But make sure that you make the move. Okay, I will see you later. I got to go work. I got to go make the move and make some 